Well, it's estimated that one third of American adults has high blood pressure and many don't even know it. NBC Local 33's Jean Burns has details tonight on how to treat what's known as a silent killer in this week's Heartbeat Reports. Health experts say if left unchecked or untreated, high blood pressure can damage blood vessels, which can lead to damage to the heart and other organs, increasing the risk of heart attack or stroke. The good news is there are things we can all do to protect ourselves. First, know your numbers. If you know you have high blood pressure, then you can take steps to reduce it. Which brings us to number two, changing your diet. Experts say reducing your salt intake can help lower high blood pressure, while eating a diet rich in fruits, vegetables, and healthy fats can improve your overall heart health. Doctors also recommend weight loss for those who need it, and combined with healthy food choices, exercising regularly can help with that and your blood pressure. And finally, if you smoke, know this. We see that when people smoke, that transiently increases the blood pressure. So people who continue to smoke, they increase the blood pressure all the time. And during a period of time, smoking causes inflammation and also makes your arteries and blood vessels more calcified and hardened. So quitting smoking is a great way to help your blood pressure and also to help your heart. Well, maybe you've tried to quit smoking on your own and have failed. Well, there's good news there, too. The Cardiovascular Institute of the South has a comprehensive smoking cessation program that can help. Uh, for more information on that program, just head to the CIS website. We have a link to it in this story on our website at BeOurProud.com.